Okay, this is 09 Golden Vulture recording the um, first episode of um, the Poker Stars cast. And today we'll be doing my top 15, my opinion, um, best um, brawlers. Okay, so this section, so the first section is the good ones. So these are just good ones, not the best, not the worst, just the good ones. Okay, so down in number 15, I've got Bo. Well, whenever you use his super and, you, and do a lot of damage, you can use it over and over again. His basic attack is also pretty good, shooting three arrows every time you touch the button to, um, to um, attack. So that is pretty good. So um, next in number 14 is Penny. A cannon does insane damage and can shoot super high and far. Then she can shoot her bags of money su super far she is definitely one of the best brawlers you can choose in Heist. I've played my Penny in Heist. I've got her to rank 1 because she used to be my worst brawler. To rank 6 to my like 7th best brawlers because I only have 9 brawlers in total. But yeah, basically um, Penny can be really good in Heist. Because like you, when all the other players are dead, you can just place a cannon right next to their safe and then that's doing incredible damage and then but like does a lot of damage but it gets knocked out like 10 seconds so i 10 seconds after so i i wish i had more hp so next in number 13 is bb so her bat it does a lot of damage but she's a bit like frank once she swings her bat the other player has either escaped or killed you so she's probably the worst bullet to choose in showdown she was still pretty decent, like, her bat does a lot of damage, but, like, it takes ages to swing. Then, in number 12, we've got Carl. Carl, 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 I don't know. I mean, his pickaxe can hit an enemy twice, and when he spins, he can hit them multiple times, if you know how to use it. Personally, Carl is one of my favourite brawlers. I mean, he moves in a minecart. I just love him, and I really want him. I still don't have Carl. Uh, yeah, he's like I've only I, I've I've tried him out that um I, but and I've only been in a battle with like w once with another Carl on the other team. But anyway, and in eleventh we have Amber. Well, she's pretty good. Her gadget is perfect because let's say gem grab again. Uh, let's say gem grab. She can use her super where you collect gems so in the middle um then stand in the puddle that she used her super then use her gadget and skid all the way to a bush to hide in the yeah and hide in the bush and then if the other team goes to the middle with a bunch of gems ignite it and they will go to lower hp and you can knock, knock them out and get their gems so that's a good way. Wait, let me just go to the next page of my notes. Okay, now this section is not the good ones anymore. It's the legends. Okay, so down in number, t in number 10, we have Rosa. She is a really good tank. She's in the tank section. She has a decent HP, good reload and speed, and does a lot of damage. And she's not even that rare. So I think she's one of the best brawlers, personally. Because let's say you're in showdown, um, you get one, you have your super ready, and you have one of those, and there's in front of you, there's one of those like energy drinks. Just drink that, and then turn super when there are brawlers around, and you're like, you get a bunch of HP, and you're giant, and it's just crazy. Then in ninth, we have Colt. Now if you get him. To a good rank then he can become very good he shoots from a far distant distance and does a lot of damage he's pretty decent in duo showdowns and broadball just wait a second i'm gonna pause here okay i'm sorry okay i'm back so next in i think let me double check okay i think in number eight is sandy i mean she can literally spawn a sandy black hole yeah, I just mean, like, she can spawn a sandy black hole. It's, like, it's 
crazy. And it could give her team an advantage in Brawl Ball and Gem Grab. I mean, she can just make one where the gems come out in the middle and collect a bunch of gems and win. Because, like, that, that thing stays there for, like, five seconds. Let's say there's a bunch of gems in the middle. Just get close to the middle, spawn one there. All the other players get, get um, um, killed when they step in it for too long. Collect all the gems and then just hide and then win. Yeah, so um, in seventh, I've got Nita. Okay, she's pretty weak on let's say rank three. I've had her on rank three before. She's not that good. I thought she was going to be one of my best brawlers when, at, at the beginning, but then she started being like one of my worst. And then, but then when you practice with her and get her up to rank 17, something like that. She becomes OP. Um, my friend Betsy Raw, you should check out her channel. She has Anita, and it's on rank, um, I think, twelve or thirteen, and it's so good. I just, she's really good. And then she does a pretty good basic stack and spawns a pretty annoying bear for the opponents because the bear knows wherever the other opponents are, even if they're in bushes. Okay, in sixth place is. 8-bit. Well, the thing that I really like about 8-bit is his basic attack. He shoots 6 laser beams at the opponent and does incredible damage. And his special attack, I think, is to heal himself, but only if he stands in the area and also poisons whoever walks in the area. I'm not sure, I've never tried 8-bit out. I, um, my friend has it, but I'm not sure what it does. I think. It either heals 8 bits when he stands in the section or poisons the other opponents, or maybe both, I don't know. Okay, wait, let me get on my notes. I need to turn around. Okay. Next is Mr. P. I mean, his suitcases can destroy a 5,000 health box in showdown with two shots and could kill a full health El Primo in three shots. And the special attack is to spawn many helpers to shoot and sometimes destroy other brawlers. So yeah, that's why I like Mr. P. Then in fourth, Rico. Okay, probably all of you now that are listening to this are disagreeing with me. But this is the reason. Because the other day, I just spawned in a random gem grab map with my, with my sister. I was using my rank 12 Colt and the other team had this Rico who I could not kill. I could never land enough attacks to kill him and by the time I respawned he had healed back to full health and the opposing team won. So that Rico, if you get him to a good rank he is pretty good. Okay, now for the top 3, oh I forgot when I started on Mr. P, Mr. P was the number 5. Um, that was he started the section of the gods now in the top three Okay Leon is in third place. Okay, Leon is actually amazing and might Move up the slot in two months because I'm gonna release a rank video every two months um, for all the brawlers and Yeah, so but for now he stays in third. I don't know if he throws shurikens or fidget spinners, but they are goods he has a pretty decent speed and reload but i love that he can turn invisible and hunt his prey without being seen but i wish it, it could last longer like 15 seconds because he can only turn invisible for like five seconds it's like i can't even i can't even i can't even i, I it's it's just so it's kind of impossible to do to do to use it that good so yeah um in second, another thing that probably you won't agree, but it's Daryl. I know, I know some people would maybe put him in 16 sort of section, so if 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 I was like other people, he wouldn't even be on, me, on, on here. But my sister has him, and he's pretty decent. I'm not a fan of his special attack, as it's basically the same as Bull's special attack. But his basic attack is, is actually great. It's just... Like he had, she is one of the best brawlers you can pick in Rollerball. Okay, and in first place, 
Some people might disagree, um, but it's actually Tick because his basic attack is pretty decent because it can either deal a lot of damage to one player or it can deal less damage but to multiple players. And his special attack can do some good damage and you don't need to aim it because his head just falls off and then it goes to the closest player like a bear. But like the bear can attack more than once and it has a HP but his head doesn't. So yeah, that will wrap up this episode. I hope you like it. So yeah, in the next episode, it won't be a Brawl Stars episode. It will be a Pokemon episode. I'm trying to think... Just for a little sneak peek, I might, it's going to take me a few months to do this, but I might try order every Pokemon for my opinion of which are um, the rank list of um, like the list of how good they are. So in my opinion, like let's say, so I'm not going to be including VMAXs or Megas. Um, so I might do that in a different video, a separate video, but I'm not going to be including those, so I'm including every single Pokemon, I'm going to try and um, sort them out by, from my opinion, which are the best. So bye, hope you liked it, and I'll see you in the next episode.